Hey YouTube, uh, today I'm going to make a video of all my snakes. And to start off with, here's my corn snake. He's back there. He's just chilling. He, I think he's in a 30 gallon tank. It's wooden. Has light fixtures in there. One for day, one for night. Because he doesn't have a heat pad. Hot side and cold side. The big water dish. Next, we have my uh, jungle carpet python. He is in a vertical cage. I'm not sure what the dimensions are either. But he's in here. So yeah, it's his cage. And I just gotta spray him down a little bit. Got a good sprayer for that. I spray him twice a day, once at night, and once, I mean, once at morning and once at night. In the morning, it's the most important because I'm out the whole day usually. And here's my ball pythons cage, which I have two of right now. A water dish is back there. Here, one sec. There's a water dish back there. You can see it. They have two hides, one here, one over there. So, this is their old hide. I have a new one, which both of them are in right now, I think. Yeah, both of them are in there. Hannibal is brighter than the other one is darker. Let's talk. Zoom in. So on the top, it's the female, and the bottom is the male. They're around the same size, but the female is really like aggressive and stuff. Like, yeah. So she's her cage. Nothing special, really. Then I have the humidity and temperature gauges up there. It's like about 90. And now we're going to the milk snake's cage. He has a 10 gallon. Oh, nice poop. I gotta get that out in a sec. Okay, so he's in a, in his coconut hide right now since it's morning. You can't see him all that well in there, but he's in there. And then usually at day, he's in this side. He has a big water dish. Most milk snakes like to soak. He soaks in there a lot. Like, every day I will see him at least once or twice in there just soaking. So I, and then, under here I have uh, my stuff. Feeding containers right now in here. I just have some coconut fiber, which I'm trying to dry. Then another feeding container, a feeding container. Then I have some stuff right here. Feeding tongs in the back, some scissors, masking tape for all the stuff. Uh, some feeding containers, carrying containers, silken containers, whatever you want to call them. Dustpan to clean up cages. A uh, snake hook that I made out of wire, some cups, some gloves, back scratcher, which can be used to pick up my uh, corn snake. I have some grapevine or driftwood back there, some moss, I have some plants right here, and then under here, I have some more stuff. I have some extra bulbs in case one breaks. Some bedding, some more bedding, water dish, some plants, and another brick of coconut fiber. So, yeah, that's it for my video today. Okay, see you, YouTube.